Hey guys, this is App Reviewer. Today we'll be taking a look at the new Candy Show Grip case for the 4th generation iPod Touch. But the colors that we're taking a look for are Special Edition and the packaging is also different. So you'll be able to pick up this case in black and gray or black and white for $34.95 on www.specproducts.com. So I, I picked up this case while I was at CES last week and I've been using it since then and I'm a big fan of it so I just want to show you guys the case itself. So this is a candy shell grip case. It has a hard shell with soft interior plus grippy pads and a shaped rim for the win. And this is for the fourth generation iPod Touch. So let's take this out and here we have the case itself. Now like the name says, this is the candy shell grip and it's basically a remake on the original candy shell and we're going to take a look at that one in comparison to this one right now. So there are three main features that are different between these. First of all, as you can see on the original candy shell, the hard plastic back is flush throughout while the candy shell grip it actually has some silicone inserts here which provide uh, some nice grip with these rub, rubber uh, waves here. So on the inside, on the can original candy shell, you do have the honeycomb feature which cuts down on weight and also adds some more shock absorption while the candy shell grip you have that flush throughout. Now the reason they did this is because the silicone that you can see right here goes just throughout the case so if you were to make those dimples there there'd be no silicone and you'd be able to get dust and everything in there. So I'm glad they did that at least. And then last but not least is on the rim of the case you do have these little dimples as you can see and what these do is they give your thumb a place to uh, stay on while you're playing your games which is pretty nice because it gives you some tactile feel so what I love about this case in comparison to the original candy shell is that because it does feature more silicone it does have some more shock absorption but also it's a little bit more manageable you can maneuver it a little bit more so it's easier to get the iPod on so I do have a full body kit got a front screen protector and a back and this fits just fine it's a super super tight fit but it fits really nicely so if you do have a regular iPod without a back screen shield then it will fit just fine and as you can see I have no bubbling of my screen protector so if we take a look at the case on it looks pretty snazzy this comes in the two tone design so I do have the red and the blue but you can also pick it up in black and gray or white and black so let's take a look at the ports and cutouts at the bottom you do have one cutout for the 30 pin dock connector, the speaker, and the 3.5mm headphone jack and that has a little dimple right there to allow you some more space to plug in headphones. Taking a look at the side, you do have rubber coverings for your volume up and down and these work just fine as you can see. At the top you do have a covering for the power button, super responsive, works fine. And at the bottom you do have one oval shaped cutout for the camera and the microphone and that works great as well, I've had no problem taking pictures. So at the front, you do have a really nice lay on the table design with that rubber lip. You can, you can place your iPod touch down and that will lift it off the surface. And now taking a look at the Candy Show Grips features, the back features that rubber wave design which feels really nice in the hand because it does provide some grip, some friction. So when you are playing games, you can hold on to that really nicely. And at the front, you do have those little dimples and what they're good for is you can just place your thumbs right there and that will just give you a place to hold them while you play with your virtual joystick or whatever you're doing. It just gives you a place to go back to if you know what I mean. So this case does retail for $34.95 like I said. I think it's an excellent case. The price might be a little steep but other than that I just think it's fantastic. In comparison to the candy shell which one I recommend, I would actually go for this case over the candy shell because it does have some more functionality at the same price and you also get more variety of colors because you do get that two-tone design so other than that thanks a lot for watching guys and stay tuned for more of my videos I will be attending Macworld 2011 in San Francisco so stay tuned for some of those videos thanks a lot guys